channels open. Uh, because the pipe can get more. Uh, after really one day, the high fed are going to be set out and out to pull the next to the air channels in place. We're gonna do a quarter of uh, manure, then we're gonna do a full bucket of uh, green material, and now we're gonna do half of wood chips of the woody material. Are we liking the paper? More paper? Yeah, we should we keep it in, bucket. like mixing it in half and half with the wood chips. Let's see if there's any. There's one. Okay. Now we can okay. Okay. This is it. We made it. We took the round. Victory! We won. One down. One down. Basically, we're looking at three different elements to make these freeze resistant in this area. Mm -hmm. uh, the first is basically just putting up a double walled hoop house. So we've got the hoop house, we've got the heat tape, and then we've got the heated hose. And those three elements are going to do it. In terms of materials, this is just a, a standard 21 foot length of one and three eighth inch fence pipe. For the covering, uh, ideally, we would be using some reused materials. Uh, it could be lumber tarping. A lot of hardware stores throw that stuff away. We've got our stainless steel adjustable clamps which can go under the hip joints, really cinch things into place. How about we lay out the general structure and then put some pieces together?
We've got two of the heat tapes. We'll wrap this okay. around the lower half of each fire rack. Securing them with zip ties, not too tight, and avoiding any sharp kinks. Alright, so here you go. Here you go on that side. But basically these will just go on over our pipes, drilled holes about every four inches or so on the bottom and about every six inches or so along the top. These create nice spray water that cover the whole surface area and soak down through the pile. All right, what we've got here is our uh, quarter, three quarter inch hose pipe with an integrated heat tape system in it. Yes. <laughs> Beautiful afternoon.